The breaking news that's coming in at the top is troubling because there's been another attack in the Jammu region. Four Indian Army soldiers have been killed, six injured in a terrorist attack in the Machedi area of Katwa. The anti-terror operation is still underway. Sources telling India today no success yet for the security forces as the terrorists may have fled. This is the fifth terror attack in the Jammu region alone in the last month. So terrorists clearly making Jammu their epicenter. All of this, remember, comes ahead of elections likely to be held in Jammu and Kashmir in September. Sunil Ji Bhatt is our man on the spot joining us live from Jammu. Sunil, give us more details. Fifth terror attack. This time, uh, the terrorists have seem to have been even more emboldened, have uh, struck uh, at this convoy. Well, Rajdeep, in the recent days, our sources in the security establishment have said that as many as 50 terrorists are currently, you know, present in different parts of Jammu region, particularly in the hilly areas. So it's a cause of huge worry. And today at about 3.30 p.m., an army convoy was moving in the Machedi area. This is a hilly stretch in Bilawar Tehsil of Katwa district. And these terrorists were hiding behind the bushes or atop the hill and the moment they saw the presence of the security forces the moment the moment they spotted army vehicle moving in that area they first lobbed a grenade and then they started firing at the army vehicle the information we are getting that we have lost four of our brave hearts Four army personnel have been martyred in this terror attack, while six others are injured and they are battling for their lives in the hospital. Meanwhile, um, uh, additional troops have been rushed to the spot, whether it's the uh, you know Indian army personnel or you know uh, personnel from the Jammu and Kashmir Police's Special Operations Group. They are carrying out an intense search operation. There were reports that the security forces had managed to establish a contact with the terrorists. There was a gunfight, but now it seems that the terrorists may have fled but uh, the security forces are on their job they have laid a cordon and the priority for them is to ensure that these terrorists who carried out this dastardly terror attack are neutralized as soon as possible but Rajdeep uh, once again you know it's a matter of huge concern that uh, terrorists are now making Jammu region their focus area and after the abrogation of article 370 and 35a there was a massive crackdown on terrorism terror ecosystem in the Kashmir Valley and that is why Pakistan and terrorists changed their strategy now they are focusing uh, in the hilly areas of Jammu region whether it's the twin border districts of Rajori and Punch or the hilly areas of now Katwa district so the security forces are trying to formulate a new strategy right. to deal with this new wave of terrorism in Jammu and Kashmir Rajiv okay we'll come to you Sunil for more details obviously these are worrying signs as you said at least 50 terrorists according Two security sources are in the mountainous terrains of Jammu and that should lead to growing concerns in the manner in which they are carrying out these attacks with impunity ahead of those elections in Jammu and Kashmir.